Hi, I'm Mateo and today we're back on Pet Simulator 99 to go over one of the most broken updates that we've got ever in the game. Inside this Thanksgiving update, Big Games gave us the ability to craft not only huge pets, but also Titanic pets. And on top of this, it's not even that hard to make the Titanic. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can easily get all of the upgrades in the newest update, as well as the best overall strategy so that you can make one of these Titanics for yourself. And if this video does help you out, remember to give it a like and subscribe for more helpful Pet Simulator 99 content. Now let's get straight into this video. All right, you guys. So here we are in Pet Simulator 99, and this is the Thanksgiving update. Now the update's been out for about eight hours now. So I don't think you guys need really any introduction, but essentially we got this brand new event world that gives us the combined omatic machine that allows you to create huge pets as well as Titanic pets. Now, obviously being able to create a Titanic pet in the first place is obviously just broken. And second off, it's actually not even that difficult at all. Again, I started playing this update a little bit late, so I am quite a bit behind. But as you can see with the amount of pets that I've opened so far, I could pretty much create three of these huge scarecrow dogs already in just like about an hour of gameplay. And if we actually go ahead and check what the wrap value of that scarecrow dog is, it's currently 86.5 million and there's already 117,000 of these in existence. So this is by far the most free to play event that we've gone so far because in just eight hours, we've gotten over a hundred and almost 20,000 huges that exist for free this isn't something that's pay to win or something that you can even pay to win to get these huges are all being opened by players and this update is especially good for you free to play players so definitely take advantage of this while you can now the reason why there's such a big supply of these huges and the wrap value is still so high at 86 million is because you can actually use these huges to make the titanic so if i head into the machine here it's kind of like one of those combining games if you've ever played it basically how you're going to craft this titanic is by starting off with the basic best stat pet that you can get from this egg which is the corn cat so you can either open up the corn cat from the egg or you can create it using these pumpkin spice cats that you also get from the egg so once you get a bunch of these corn cats you can then go ahead and create a huge scarecrow dog using it now how much pets it's going to take you in order to make one of these is solely going to depend on your upgrades which i'll go over in a second there actually is a very good strategy for being able to get all of those upgrades so make sure you actually don't go ahead and combine anything until you get all of those upgrades because it's going to make it a whole lot cheaper and allow you to get this titanic pilgrim turkey so essentially you just go down the line because once you make a few of these huge scarecrow dogs you can turn those huge scarecrow dogs into a huge pumpkin spice cat and then with those pumpkin spice cats, you can combine them to make a huge corn cat. And then finally, you can use that to make a Titanic Pilgrim Turkey. So this is an absolutely free to play Titanic. It is absolutely insane. And the fact that there's 120,000 of these first huges already in eight hours of the update being out is absolutely crazy, you guys. This huge is set to be the most common huge in the game so far, especially if we keep going at that same rate. And you can also get the huge scarecrow dog just from opening the egg as well so you can get it right here it is like the special huge and then on top of that you also have the chance just to get the regular active huge as well and really quickly before i forget i should also point out that you can do the same process using all the different types so you can do it either golden regular rainbow and then you can also do these shiny versions of each of these three so if you really wanted you could actually make a rainbow shiny titanic pilgrim turkey but obviously that is going to be very costly and i'll have this screenshot on the screen here from copycat on twitter who basically just did the math with the max upgrades how much of these pets it's going to take in order to make one titanic pilgrim turkey so at max upgrades it's going to take you 3125 pumpkin spice cats or 625 corn cats or 125 scarecrow dogs or 25 huge pumpkin spice cats 
or just five corn cats. So honestly, the fact that it only takes 625 of these corn cats to make a Titanic is absolutely insane, you guys. As you can see, there's already 1.63 million of these that exist. The fact that you only need 625 of these corn cats in order to make a Titanic, if you divide that 1.63 million number by the 625, that means essentially somebody could create like 2,500 Titanics just out of the corn cats that have been open so far. I think you guys get the idea. This is just absolutely insane update from big games. I'm not sure what they're trying to do. This update honestly might crash the prices of pretty much everything in the game. I think it's a very good idea to pretty much stock up on gems at this point because big games have been giving away a lot of free to play methods to get Titanics lately. So I feel like the prices of all of the hugest and Titanics are just going to go down over time with all of the supply being added added especially if we already got over 120,000 of the basic huge opened in the first eight hours now let me try to stop the yapping too much because we really have to get going all right you guys so the number one thing you must be focusing on in this update if you do want that titanic turkey is that you must be spending your maple leaves in the most effective way and that's because if you don't spend it then it is actually going to cost you a lot more of the regular pets in order to craft all the way up to the titanic so inside the the upgrade machine essentially what you're going to want is to get two of these upgrades and those two upgrades are going to be the more egg luck as well as the pet savings so pretty much pet savings is the one you want to focus on more but more egg luck is also going to allow you to get all of those things inside the egg that you're going to need to actually craft the pets and in order to buy these upgrades you are going to have to spend these maple leaves and in order to get the maple leaves on the change log it says that you just get them like randomly but there is actually a way you can get a ton of these pretty easily and that method to get the maple leaves is actually going to be by opening the new gifts that we got called the autumn gifts so if i actually go ahead and open one of these hopefully i can get some of the leaves from it to show you how good these are so as you can see i just got five from that gift and essentially i think you can get between like five and ten autumn leaves per item slot so essentially through the four item slots, you can get like up to 30, 40 autumn leaves at once just from one gift. So these autumn gifts are by far the best way to get the autumn leaves. And you also get the autumn gifts from this chest so much. Like really quickly, if we check, I have 54 autumn gifts right now. And then after breaking that chest, you can see that we get, we just got nine of the autumn gifts from breaking that chest. That is absolutely insane, you guys. And I know the rat value only says 600K for these autumn gifts, but they actually sell for way, way more. I think they sell for upwards of more than 2 million diamonds at the moment of recording this. It honestly might be even more just because people are trying to get all of these upgrades. So they are willing to spend top dollar for all of these gifts. And the luck upgrade is going to allow you to get all of these corn cats and the pumpkin and spice cats that you need to craft all the way up to the pilgrim turkey but the uh, savings one is going to uh, lower the amount of these that you need so personally i would probably try to go for the savings one first and then get the luck one but personally i'm just going for both at the same time and just upgrading them as i get the leaves and then there's also another strategy that you can use to actually double hatch this egg here now if you don't know how this method works i'll demonstrate you really quickly all you need is an auto clicker and essentially you're just gonna want this e button to be over where you buy the most eggs that you can afford so like right here on the egg is like the special spot i'd like to use where you can easily hover over both and then just make sure you have auto hatch off and then you're just going to want to turn on your auto clicker and essentially it's going to press both of these buttons at once and then every couple batch of pets that you open it's actually going to double open and open two times the amount of the most eggs that you can open so so for me i'm opening 102 eggs right here so that means i'd be opening 204 at once and sometimes there is actually this error message that pops up you probably can't even see it because i'm clicking off of it so fast but if that does happen just make sure you hover over that button as well and then you can essentially use this to open up tons and tons of pets in order to make this titanic pilgrim turkey but yeah doing that method is very important as well just so you are able to get as much of this as possible and then craft all the way down to the titanic pilgrim turkey at the time of recording this there are already 59 of these pilgrim turkeys in existence and this number probably isn't very updated at all 121,000 of the first huge 
5,000 of the second tier huge and then 500 of the corn cats. So basically using these 500 corn cats, that is another 100 Titanic Pilgrim turkeys that could be made. Also the free slot in the Crimson pack also gives you one of those autumn gifts for free. So make sure you open the exclusive shop so that you can get that. And then hopefully you can also get some more maple leaves from that. Besides that, in this update, we did get a brand new battle pass sitting at 1600 Robux. Now what this does is actually gives you an additional bonus chance at getting shiny pets. Personally, I'm not going to get this. I don't know if it's really that worth it for you guys, but I guess if you do a lot of opening of pets anyways, this might be worth it. And then they also dropped this exclusive enchant that increases your chance at hatching rainbow pets. Now, this one is a whopping 2,900 Robux, so I definitely wouldn't suggest buying this. I would definitely just try to get the gems in-game if you really do want it. But either way, that is pretty much it for today's video. Hopefully, this helped you out. I'll probably be having a video on a more in-depth way of getting all of the upgrades out soon, so look out for that video. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope to catch you in the next one, and peace out.